What's up guys? SmallBC here with a new old game. I know, weird, right? A new old game. So, um, this is actually an old game. It's from 2007, so it's al already five years old. Ooh, thunder. Uh, this game is Command and Conquer, a uh, Kane edition. Um, I've got this game new for me, at least. So, that's why it's a new old game. And we're going to do the campaign of the GDI. So I did the tutorial, so I know what I need to do. It's kind of like Red Alert or Starcraft or Battle of Middle Earth. Thank you. Today's threat level is low. The state of the planet is deteriorating. Tiberium infestation has reached critical levels. Red zones have suffered the worst contamination and cannot support human life. Yellow zones are dangerously contaminated, but contain most of the world's population. Decades of war and civil unrest have left these regions in a state of social collapse. The Brotherhood of Nod operates virtually unchallenged in these zones. They take advantage of the chaos to recruit members and disguise their military infrastructure. Nod's leader is a charismatic figure we know only as Kane. Kane is determined to accelerate the spread of Tiberium, believing it is the catalyst for the next stage of human evolution. However, in recent years, the Brotherhood has been suspiciously quiet, with little terrorist activity. The remainder of the Earth's surface is unscarred oh, by York. Tiberium outbreak. These blue zones are considered the last refuge and hope of the civilized world, and are under the protection of the Global Defense Initiative. You have been assigned command of the GDI forces stationed on the eastern seaboard of the United States. Good luck, Commander. Alright, so I think this game's pretty epic. And, um, for the graphics, uh, pretty low. Just I want to see how it runs, but for now it runs pretty good. No lag. Ooh, movie. Oh, wait, I know this movie. And these type of movies. I think this is actually... Commander! General Jack Granger, good to have you on board. These... These are interesting times. I don't know if you know it, but Inops has downgraded Nod's threat level to low. With Kane apparently dead, Nod has been fractured by internal power struggles. Recruitment's down 25% and they've abandoned four bases in the last year. The prediction is another decade of peace. Me? I say it's the calm before the storm. For 28 years of fighting out, there's one thing I can say with absolute certainty. As long as there's Tiberium on Earth, Nod is a serious threat. If our intel says otherwise, it's because Nod wants us to take them off our radar. That's why I want you to go to North Carolina. His own security stop would look like a Protoss delivery truck yesterday, but it turned out to be a Nod vehicle. Before it could be searched, the driver blew it up himself along with it. I want you to take some troops down there, see what you can turn up. Hopefully I'm wrong and this is just a false alarm. But if I'm right, be prepared for the worst. This is Lieutenant Sandra Telfair. She's from Inops. She'll give you all the details of the mission. Lieutenant? Sweet. Good afternoon, Commander. Good afternoon. Glad to be of service. Here's what we know so far. After the delivery truck incident, we turned Sky Sentry onto the area. And bingo, we located a high output subterra energy grid in the middle of nowhere. Obviously, Nod's up to no good. Your ace in the hole is an old base we have there. Bring it back online and you can recon the entire area. My advice is to engage the enemy only if necessary. No telling what those maniacs are hiding down there. Good luck, Commander. I'm here if you need me. Ooh, that sounds cool. Alright, so, uh, recent satellite intelligence points that to a suspicious level of activity in the North Carolina Badlands. Inops is con concerned that the Brotherhood of Nod may be settling up a shop there. Your mission is to investigate and report back as soon as possible. An abandoned GDI training facility is located nearby. Use that as your base of operations in the area. Alright, so this game really reminds me of Red Alert actually. I think it is from Middle Earth, I'm not sure. This is something I don't know. Alright. Uh, 
But um, I just figured out that the Command of Conquer 3. So. Oh, and um, I also have the DLC. Let's see. How's it called? Ugh. Kane's Wrath. Expansion package. Packet. I don't know. So, I guess we are. We are going to play S. Kane, or. What? So, I have to. And it's all pretty epic. At least I think it's going to be a cool game. Yeah, all right. Oh, we can play. Well, sorry, I was focused on the expansion package. Greetings, Commander. This is GDR Battle Command. Here to get you up to speed on some of the ground operations for this mission. All right, cool. Establishing the new uplink. Commander, we need you to locate the old GDI You're uplink someone else. and investigate rumors of a Nod presence in the area. Incoming transmission. Support. This outpost was abandoned many years ago after its strategic value waned. Once you arrive at the outpost, it can be reactivated remotely. Good to be out on patrol duty. Ready for orders, Commander. Alright, this base looks pretty sweet. Hey, car! Enemy unit sighted. What enemy unit? Enemy attack! Unit under attack. Yeah, I know. Whoa, well, now I'm lagging. The game froze. Oh, there Looks it is. like Nod is here after all. Eradicate the Nod oh, forces oh, occupying our outposts. Once those forces are evicted, we'll restore the outpost remotely, granting you access. Good girl. Alright. Just collecting set. that. Just doing that. Intelligence data updated. Yes, sir. Move. Move. Tiberium is the only resource you need to collect. Once you've built a refinery, your harvester will automatically seek it out. Once the harvester is full or the field is depleted, the harvester will return and begin refining the Tiberium. Intelligence data updated. Ground support. What? Uh, I'm not going to read this. You know, oh, wait. Uh, I'm just going to show you one thing. Pause the video, read it if you want. Alright, pause the video, read it if you want. Pause the video, read it. There we go. Now this you is will. your mobile construction vehicle. Tank! Oh, wait. It'll allow you to construct various structures. I know. I was joking. Intelligence data updated. Squad ready. Rifle squad. Automatic. Guys, let's get out of the way. He's going to build up a fortress. Move up. Move. Establishing the oh, yeah. Commander. You will need a bigger force to stop now. Select your construction yard or the structure tab on the command bar, then click the barracks icon. I know how I need to play. I did the tutorial. Incoming transmission. Before engaging more Nod forces, bolster your own army with infantry. From your construction yard, build a barracks. Then from your barracks, train three rifleman squads. Alright, that was... Yes, I was sir. planning to do that. Thank you, anyways. Construction complete. Alright, build the barracks. Data updated. New construction options. Training. Three riflemen, right? Alright. From a barracks or other production structure, you can queue up multiple units. Multiple structures of the same type allow for additional build queues. Intelligence squad ready. data updated. Rifle squad ready. Yes, sir. Objective complete. Rifle squad ready. Keep your weapon ready. Support. Rifle Understood. squad ready. Move! Enemy unit sight. Okay! Yes, sir. Make a push! Yes, sir! Our base is under attack. How did they one hit that? 
Reporting in. Lost. Rifleman. Commander, your base is low on power. For additional power, build a power plant from your production tab. Yeah, I was expecting that. But one hit? Holy crap. Yes, transmission. Oh, transmission. To restore your base to full power, build a power plant. Alright. I don't care. In the meantime, you can remove buildings from the power grid to free up more power. This will allow the rest of your base to continue functioning. To do this, click on the lightning bolt button at the top of your command bar. Then click this? on a structure. Yeah. Only structures that require power can be turned off. You may need to turn off more than one structure in order to meet your power requirements. Building offline. Construction complete. Building offline. Alright, so now we have power. That's something that does confuse me. Complete. New construction options. Well done. The green power bar located on the left side of the minimap indicates that your base now has enough power. Oh, that's pretty transmission. Cool. Repair the command post to help restore this GDI base. All right, repair button. I got it. Repairing. Objective complete. Battlefield expanded. Repairing. Repairing. Commander. It seems Nod has noticed us. They're sending a force to destroy our base. Ooh. Quickly build and deploy a watchtower base defense from the support structure tab. On hold. Cancelled. Building. New bonus objective. Build a watchtower. I was doing that. I was, I was, I was building that. Construction complete. Bonus objective complete. They're attacking! Yes, Back! Move up. Turret! Enemy combat zone! Go over! Yes! Roger that, sir! Harvester under attack! Harvester run! Alright, those are full on health. Gonna build something else! Unit on What does this do? Unless. Raiders. Establishing video uplink. All right, Commander. You need to push forward and destroy the Nod outpost guarding that bridge. I'm sending reinforcements now. Squad one thing I've noticed. Nod presence appears to be minor. Eliminate these dangerous Nod structures. All right. But one thing I've noticed. If you have... Squad ready. Uh, uh, squad reinforcements have theater role or role complete. to play in this game you have the best job ever Roger out. Ooh, what are you ready. missile can we build more of the not presence additional squads of missile soldiers have been requisitioned yes, sir. missiles are much more effective against structures than standard GDI rifles boom Pay attention! Missile squad ready for combat! Listen up, missile squad! New bonus objective! Isn't it? Oh, uh, I was going to build it over here. Ground support! Keep your weapon ready! Alright, we're going to put it up here. What do I need to do? Power plant. You know what I want to do? Not a power plant. What's the lowest bar? I don't get it. Squad ready. All right, let's blow this up. I don't know what it is. Do it. Them. They're pretty much dead right now. Rocket launchers. Boom. Those do a lot of damage to those. Construction complete. And you thought you could fight me, Nod? Light you funny. No, Light wait, I want to keep that one alive. Move. Just to troll them. Another power plant over here. But I don't know. What do I need? What was my secondary objective? Objectives. Build a second infant. Build a second barracks. Oh, barracks. All right. I can build another barracks. Rifle squad. Reporting in. Affirmative. Let's go, boys. Move up. Nope. Wait. Rifleman, move out. 
All right, let's go that. Construction complete. Bonus objective complete. Bonus yes, objectives sir. are awesome. Fire! Boom! Boom! Objective complete. Roger that, sir. One away. What are they dropping? Or no, that's mine. Incoming transmission. Further investigation of the area is needed. Oh, we need to repair the bridge. All right, that's awesome. I'm skipping the, all those uh, tutorial parts because it's pretty clear what they want us to do. Engineers have two important functions. First, they can repair structures and bridges. Second, they can capture enemy structures and tech buildings, allowing.